Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Madonna with Little Line Art helping you with drawing ideas for beginners. For today's video, I'm going to test this Tombow Mono Drawing Pens. I'm so excited, so let's open it. And if you watch me draw lately, I have been drawing with micro pens, so today I'm going to try these pens. Have you tried Tombow Mono Drawing Pens before? These pens are so light, so I have this three sizes, 05, 03, and 01. So before I proceed to drawing, I'm just gonna try different marks on paper. So these pens are made in Japan and I got this for roughly $10. And it is a water-based pigment ink marker and it's non-refillable. I decided to try each pen or size of pens before proceeding to drawing and because this will give me ideas already and I love the zero one size so much and this will be great for very fine details this pen is super super light and I'll just make random marks for each sizes so you can see the difference and I'm amazed that it is smudge or it does dry up quickly or instantly anyway let's draw now so today i randomly pick a subject and this is a drawing on the spot let me think for a while okay let's try to draw a fish yes a fish so i will just draw this directly in pen and i will not gonna draw it super realistic let's start with the head then the body oh yes don't forget the eyes and tail of course and I'm using the zero one for drawing the outline of the fish and then definitely add some fins I overdo the tail I think but that's okay just keep going let's add some lines to the tail to look a bit interesting this pen is really amazing I highly recommend this they are very similar to American pens but I'm going to use different kinds of pens throughout this drawing to see how the thickness of different weight of lines to look like to a one drawing so this is kind of cool experiment i'm trying to be careful not to draw or put a lot of pressure to the pen so much you know sometimes when we use pens or when it's new, you kind of reluctant to use it very well to the fullest, but don't be shy to depend. Our supplies are happy when we use it very well. They are made more than just for a collection or display. What is your favorite pens? Please comment down below. I would love to hear it. The Sierra 5 has great lines or fatter or thicker name or tip so it's great really for shading big areas and let's leave some white areas for the fins and now let's draw some scale scales can be tricky to draw so this time I just decided to draw like shapes overlapping like half moon it can be very details or tedious but carry on I never drew this kind of fish before that has a lot of scales but this exercise is great for practicing patience about in details and when you have some new supplies you will be really motivated or inspired to draw also but please use whatever you have there if you want to draw with me if this pen is not available to you use whatever you have already there but if you can purchase it or you want to try this it's definitely a great supply to try Tombow Mono drawing pens are water-based ink markers so it is not waterproof and the pigments were mixed by using water alcohol markers they are waterproof and if you will use for mixed media like for example with watercolors it's better to use it uh, over the top because from my opinion if you will mix it with watercolors i think 
the result will not be so great or it will go into belief. All in all, I am curious how long it will last for this pants. I think it depends how much you use it or you draw with it. I'll definitely let you know in the future. So I'm going to go back now to the scales. I'm just going to add some more details to the scales to add more some values a little bit and tiny tiny details try out not to overdo it so i really love the zero one side in general all in all it is a great pen it is really smooth to work with right now i'm using a regular smooth paper sketch pad paper and zero one is super great for adding details or fine details and if you have any suggestions for the next topic just comment down below and i would love to see what spark you and i'm thinking for underwater creatures series for this week so there you go guys thank you for watching draw this fish using tombow mono drawing pens subscribe for more drawing tips tutorials and art supply reviews Keep drawing and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.